So the reason that lithium has now become the uh, material of choice for batteries uh, is twofold. One, it's the third lightest element, hydrogen, helium, lithium. Uh, so, so a light element, but also the lightest metal. The other reason is because it has the highest charge density of any metal. So you can put more electrons per unit area than any other material. So combine the weight aspect and, and the charge density, and you have the best material for making light, long-lasting batteries. There are two main sources of lithium. Uh, one is a hard rock lithium, which, which is what we have in Quebec. We mine a, a 1% lithium oxide in the ground. It, it's a white uh, hard rock material hosted by granite. Uh, we take a 1% rock, we convert it into a 6% concentrate, and then into a 99.5% battery carbonate. The other source of material is the brines, predominantly in South America, Chile and Argentina. They take a 0.1% brine solution, which is made up of sodium and chlorine and potash and lithium. They use the sun to evaporate those solutions and then produce again a, a lithium carbonate. The main difference between the two processes is timing. Ours is a five-day process. We mined on a Friday, we produce lithium carbonate on a Wednesday. It's a five-day process. If you mine a brine, you pump it to the surface, 2013, you might produce lithium carbonate in 2014, 2015, 2016. It depends on the weather, it depends on evaporation, it depends on rainfall. So a much more regulated production coming out of hard rocks, a much more slower production coming out of brine. So a laptop or a cell phone uses anything from five grams to 10 grams of lithium carbonate. So a small amount, but a large number of applications. So most people in the world have a cell phone or they have a laptop. So most people are carrying around 10 to 30 grams of lithium carbonate. Once you start talking about electric vehicles, then significantly bigger numbers. So you have in a hybrid about five kilos of lithium carbonate and a plug-in hybrid about 15 kilos and in a full electric vehicle such as a, a Nissan Leaf, about 25 kilos. So you're going from grams to kilos. And then the big grid storage batteries, these, these are batteries that hold 20 megawatts or 30 megawatts or 50 megawatts of power. They use about half a ton per megawatt. So a 50 megawatt battery would hold 25 tons of lithium carbonate. So demand for lithium carbonate, the battery grade carbonate, has grown very strongly over the last 10 years. In 2000, 2002, demand was about 50,000 tons a year. Currently, it's sitting at about 140,000 tons a year and growing strongly. So demand initially was driven by portable applications, laptops and cell phones. But now you've got the introduction of electric vehicles. So you have hybrids, plug-in hybrids, and, and full electrics. And each of these using multiple kilos of, of demand. So over the next 10 years, demand is uh, slated to grow by another 100%, so basically going from 150,000 tons a year to 300,000 tons a year. Thank you.